just want you all to take a second to appreciate my new bottle opener. Alcoholism. I am here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus, and today we have the next one in the MHA brand new season, Inflation. Last episode was probably one of the best in the series thus far with a fat cliffhanger pinned on the fate of my mommy, Mirko. The hero's plan went very well, but Deku is not exactly where he's supposed to be. He's very far from Shigaraki, aka basically all for one now. So I'm guessing this one's going to be absolute madness. Let's get into it. If you're new to the channel, drop a sub, drop a like on this one if you haven't already. And let's get into it. How was I just tricked into watching a four minute recap? My hero! Wait, that means stuff has to go down here. <laughs> Mr. Last Boss. <laughs> I hope there isn't some plot point where he laughs so much that it actually messes up the plan. Dude! It's like all CG! But how is it not a quirk? It's growth. That is so gross! Where society is heading? That is disgusting! God, how much of Shigaraki is still in there? She's alive! Oh my, she got replacements! She's back in it already! That's my goat! How far is Okuto land from there? He can't warp! He's busy doing the, the, uh, the quirk erasure. I feel like we're gonna go fight by fight. 200 kilometers on the coast? I'm gonna pretend like I know how far a kilometer is. Oh, an aquarium, nice. Of course, Gang Orca fights here. Bro, I wanna see Gang Orca go crazy. He's one of my favorite teacher designs. He's so cool, man. Gang Orca versus Nomu? Oh my gosh. I remember this guy from the, uh, the prison. That was a questionable cut. There's Toga. Well, oh, Toga's heart targeting him. <laughs> Uruk is just like, I just want to talk. Dude, she's like immune to his reactions. His actual danger. Like, she doesn't want to hurt him? Or she doesn't want to kill him? <laughs> this isn't a bad path. Oh my gosh, come on. He's like stunned. He's so stuck on that word. What am I watching? Wait, does she actually have a crush on him? I want to crawl on your skin. This is just your regular schmegular crush, man. Deku, people are dying! Oh my god, Uruk is getting jealous. What am I watching? Yeah, I don't think you're thinking of a typical boyfriend. She wants to be inside your body. So that's why it doesn't work, because she loves him, but wants to harm him with love. She's like a natural counter to that ability. But isn't that still danger? Does he successfully talk no jutsu her? Okay, okay. Oh, maybe she's never been shown like that direct love back, despite being like this unhinged. Her eyes are open. Oh no, she can't be changed. Is she gonna like ask them to adopt her? Wait, I thought she was slowly turning. Oh my gosh, what happened? She's saying they're the same as her parents. Like they didn't understand. How do you win? Like what, what does she want to hear? Oh my gosh. If she actually stabs her, Deku's gonna go bananas. Robby, let's go. Yeah, bro, Deku's just standing around apparently. Don't you dare tell me that Deku stays here. Go, go, listen to her. Yes. He's gonna get whipped down, I swear, bro. Yo! Shit! That looks sick! He can only go so fast. Oh, <gasps> another holder. <laughs> <laughs> that look. Oh, a unique power? What since they're like stacked on? Do I like her with a mask on? It looks, it looks sick. Yeah, if you can, I can too. Kemino Ward. This is where uh, Todoroki is, no? And Dobby? Is that a Nomu? Wait, bro, this fight's gonna go crazy. It's setting them all up. There's, I feel like this is straight up just gonna be a 1v1. They're doing the effect again. I love that, bro. The sound effect effect. Oh, he's mad Endeavor didn't come? Oh, the trajectory of the air around me. Bro is Gojo. Okay. This squad was made for him. 
He trained on an Endeavor. They did. He's standing here to put down his brother. Yes! We get to fight this episode. Oh my gosh, the city. Oh, Spinner, man. Dog, the hands inside the dome. It's just going to keep growing, too. Ah! Is it just me? Or did that feel like it was five seconds long? I was get, I was I was gearing up for an answer and everything. Are you kidding? So we get Deku leaving. Dobby saying hi to Todoroki, and that's it! Oh, it's gonna be a long season, man. It's gonna be a long one. Okay, I'm still a little bit confused on the whole like oh, like one for all awakening, like the meta powers, and then how he said what did he say like they stack on to create something new or special? The meta power is the last resort though he said it's transformed into a unique power but it's still locked up and i have a feeling we're going to see that same door again and the locks are gonna like slowly bust open or something i don't know not something that can be used the same way it was used in the past so it's something brand new a brand new power that is like the culmination of everything i'm very curious also how this entire plot line with toga will end because it doesn't seem like it feels like if she was able to be reasoned with at this point it would have found an out by now so it almost feels like the only out out for toga is death and i feel like that's the, the most tragic part about it is she will never feel comfortable being herself and instead she will always just lash out until till someone finally stops her and it's almost like she won't realize that until the moment of death or like she won't find peace until that moment at least that's what it feels like i hope it doesn't go down like that that'd be really sad like i said it feels like we've come such a long way with toga and like like they said they've had so many interactions and meetings that it would have found a way out by now and even now in this, this what feels like final conference there is no out she is doubling tripling quadrupling down but now we know the exact situation with shigaraki though and the fact that if yeah if his quirks are enabled everything and everyone just dies instantly because they built this coffin in the sky with the the, the mindset that he's one man that can touch only so many things at once but even disabled he now has this enormous body that can touch practically the entire dome at once and would obliterate the whole dome instantly so yeah this whole disabling the quirk thing is infinitely more important now okay not gonna lie while last episode we did have a lot of development especially with toga at the same time did we i don't know we got a long season to go so we'll see what they throw at us police station whose voice is that <laughs> why does it sound familiar the doctor, the professor, yeah, no, no, the doctor, the scientist. For seeds born warm. For seeds worthy. Dobby? Well, we don't get more of an ominous start than that. <laughs> Dobby and Todoroki? Wait, what was the title of the episode? Two flash fires? Wait, maybe they're the, the flash fires. <laughs> oh my gosh. We didn't see this in the original flashback, right? Bro, the animation is insane. Childborn warp. That's like a theme. That like you're not gonna be on a straight and narrow path. Oh my gosh! Wait, we're getting like more backstory. Oh. 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 He sounds so young. Who's Mr. Sunny? What is happening? And it was like his child voice. I'm so lost. Oh, hell no. This is so cursed. They started messing with his mind. Oh, it was three years. He was actually unconscious for three. Wait. Oh, his dreams of being a hero. Oh, it all came crashing down. Wait, she even showed Deku for a second, I'm pretty sure. Like, finding out he couldn't be a hero. Maybe I'm crazy. I might be crazy. Uh, create the problem, sell the solution. <laughs> Mr. Sunny, no! He burned everything down and ran! <laughs> It, it was meticulously. He showed all the branches that we have. <sighs> Gosh, bro, his physical body was destroyed. His soul pushed forward. 
What? He wanted to go back. Oh. <gasps> Everything was the exact same. Oh my gosh. Oh, the music's kicking up. Oh. He's burning. Why is there a guitar riff? on YouTube! Bro, watch footage! Because that was the more to bring down. Bro, what is this guitar? Dude! Oh, no! He's lost full! Dobby's crashing out! Oh, my God, bro. I thought the episode was about to end. They bet they fit a fight, dog. They fit a fight! Oh, no! Oh no, I gotta crank my volume. Bro, we're getting analysis of moves. He's using Endeavor's moves. Increasing your own heat as high as possible. Oh no. Bro, what yo Toroki's chest. He looks so insane, man. He told him. That was like the spark. He should have never told him that. Oh, his body was numb. He copied Endeavor's moves. They have a plan. What is he? Is he charging? Oh, shoot. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, the soundtrack. Bro, he's pissed. He's taking out his whole life on him. Someone help him. Holy shit. Fight back, Todoroki, please. Oh, my God, bro. We're getting close. What is it? What is the light? What is this light? The ice. The ice. Oh, he called him. Both sides of them are colliding. Oh. He's gonna do the same back. Oh. Oh. He made a move to stop him. My power is the one best to face Toya. That's been his plan. Is it an angel choir? Oh my gosh, this is insane. Oh my gosh, Ida Cheeks! He been put on this plan all along, man! He wanted this! He wanted to smoke! He was, he was, he was training it. Essence of flash fire. What? Bro, sets his heart literally ablaze. To create a neutrality. Oh my god, bro. He unlocked a secret skill tree. Oh! I guess we gotta see this. Phosphor? It's blinding! Is he freezing him? The power to cool Dobby's flames, despite him not even worrying about his physical body. Dude, they popped off with everything here. He canceled it. Oh no! It's blinding! Oh, he's gone. Todoroki's gone. It was part of the plan. They gave them their energy? They gave Todoroki... What is happening? She told him that from the very beginning, baby. Your own hero. Aww. They didn't leave Aoyama behind, bro, and he inherently betrayed them, and they still didn't abandon him. Store it up in fire. Literally fire. Dude, the framing of every scene this episode has been insanity. He's hitting him! No way it puts him down though. Oh my. Gra Glacial? Is that them young? No way. Oh shit. He made an ice age. He ulted. Oh. Oh. He's not down. He did. Oh my god, bro. That 
was insane. Bro, I need to talk to the music director of this episode. This episode was like ups and downs like crazy. Like cutting the backstory away from backstory, like explanations back to dude. Insanity. Bro, Dobby was like, yep, I've been prepping something for you and I've been storing it up for you. And Todoroki was like, yeah, same. I like how it was him completely using both sides in, in perfect balance because that's always what Todoroki's character has been about. The conflict between which to use more and how scared he used to be to use even the fire side, but how much he needed all the power inside of him to be able to take on people and take on the cross that his family bears, like he said. But bro, like I said, just the cinematography of that entire episode went nuts. And it's seemingly over, bro. Like I figured whenever these two collided, they were going to clash for several and it was going to be one we cut back and forth to, back and forth to. But I love it so much more when they just dedicate one fat episode because it, it, it lets you stay locked in, stay connected, stay really engaged with their stories and what's truly at stake here for both of their characters. Oh, my boy pulled through, baby. So we might see the fallout of this. I don't know. There's a 50 50 shot that we don't even see anything else going forward from this. And we instead just see the fallout later on and what happens after. But it seems like he won. And now I kind of see why the last episode was a tiny bit slow because they couldn't really get started on this. And now we're here. Guys, that's been it for my reaction today to two flash fires. Absolute insanity. Drop a like if you haven't already, and I'll catch you next time. Peace, base.